Hi everybody, it's Laura. Welcome back to my channel. I'm here for another plan with me for the week of Memorial Day through the end of May. What? <laughs> um, I am going to use this kit from Glam Planner, which was the November mystery. And when I hauled this, I was kind of like, I mean, yeah, it's pretty, but like, I don't know if it's my style, but maybe I'll try to use it. And that's essentially where we're at. So <laughs> I haven't really been using like stay at home kind of kits because I've been working from home. So um, this week, Monday is, I mean, technically it's Memorial Day, but I'll be finishing work. My grades are due Tuesday and then the rest of the week is my summer break. So I decided to finally use like a kind of stay at home sort of kit. I have some coming from Dutch Girls Design also, which I can't wait for, but um, like I literally can't wait for them either because <laughs> I need a spread down. Um, and I thought this was really fun, like light and pretty. Um, there's like this adorable bedroom scene. Um, I really like this girl. Um, so there's like planner supplies and books and things. So I just thought it would be kind of fun to do something a little different. We have some checklists here. I love these colors. Like this orchid pink is so my jam. And if you're going to give me a purple, like this super pastel periwinkle with the silver glitter, I love it. Then we have the gray and like the peachy pink. So pretty, so much functional stuff. We have all the fun little like old school SPC boxes. I don't know what this box is. It's like a tiara and maybe tarot cards. I don't know. Um, labels, this is the ultimate kit because this was a mystery. So I'm not used to getting <laughs> this many stickers from her. I almost never buy her ultimate kits. Um, deco and beacon banner and all that bottom washi which is really pretty the extra full box um and then the date headers or date covers and then you also get the label sampler the 15 millimeter strip which i'm really excited about because in this planner like i have multiple days of washi to do um so i'm excited about that and then you have the beautiful glitter header colors and then you also get these tall girls and you guys know in this planner i love to just kind of throw full boxes around all over the place so this past week i used so many so this was glam planner i used so many full boxes and you can see I kind of journaled on some of these because I was really sick. I didn't necessarily get a lot of work done these days. Like nap. <laughs> um, today is Saturday. I basically, I woke up early, stayed in bed for a few hours, and then I got up for a little bit, and then I went back to bed for a few hours. So it was kind of a roughness, but it's okay. And then we recently just got this. Um, lavender hollow foil from SPC in her what was it May mystery for this year like the surfboard one um, so I probably won't be using all of this um, but I figured these colors would go really well and like there's plenty of everything so I just figured I would try to pull in some lavender hollow with this kit because it's got that like purpley orchid color i don't know and it definitely like the kit definitely lends itself to hollow like hollow is going to be gorgeous with this so if i give you this with like the icon sheet like it's a little weird but i feel like this color in general is a little weird so i don't know we're gonna use it it's it's different. It's all different and we're just gonna play because I'm not too concerned about it. It's interesting too, her top sheet is a little bit different color than the rest of them. Must have switched ink or something partway through printing. Um, okay, so like I said, Monday I have to work. Tuesday my grades are due, so like I need to be available for work. I need to be available for any last minute emails, that kind of thing. That's just marking a bill. This is marking a reminder. <laughs> um, so Monday, Tuesday are gonna be a little busy. 
and the rest of the week should be so calm that I don't even know what I'm doing with my life. This little tab right here says June um, because it flips to the June monthly, which is from Lexi Kylie Designs, by the way. Okay, I have 18 zillion full boxes, but I think I want to start with washi. Wherever it is, because... Yeah. Okay, so maybe Monday, Tuesday, I'll do the skinnier washi because those days I have more to do. And then I'll do the thicker washi Thursday, Friday. Sounds good to me. Um, I'm assuming most of you, if your parents, well, if you're college students, I'm assuming you're done. If your parents, I'm assuming most of you are still going. I know my like Canada friends, you guys always tell me that you go later and you're always shocked at how early I'm done. <laughs> and then my East Coast and West Coast friends, I think you guys go later also. Um, I know the Midwest typically um, goes like about a week after we do. I don't know why we go so early. But we do. So we start early August and then we're out end of May. So in case you were unfamiliar, and I'm talking about school, by the way, because <laughs> like, I'm not using my words, apparently. Um, school goes August to May in Colorado. And our colleges also seem to go August through May. Um, but just like slightly different dates. I did not line that up well at all. And I don't even care. Like half of it's going to get covered with full boxes. So probably doesn't really matter. <laughs> um, but like I said, Monday, Tuesday, I decided to go with the skinnier washi just because I, I do have things I need to mark the rest of this week. I don't know what I'm going to do. I need to start working out again. No more excuses, right? Like, I'm not going to be working. I don't know. I just, it's not been happening. But I really need to <laughs> work out some more. And what else do I need to do? I'll need the clean. I haven't really kept up with cleaning this week because I've been sick. So I definitely need, like, a good... A good full cleaning again not just like picking things up every day like I need to vacuum I need to clean my shower um, you know cleaning <laughs> oh I want to work on my power sheets because I haven't prepped them for June at all and if my June monthly kit comes in I will need to film that even though like what the heck am I gonna mark in June I have no idea like I feel like it's gonna be even less than April and May because April and May um I had at least like some work things and like some birthdays and stuff but there's like no holidays in June and then I don't think do I know anybody's birthday in June I don't think I know birthdays and then I have no plans. I would like to um, go home to Wisconsin and visit probably June into July, but I don't know what that's going to look like yet. I was going to use big checklists, but I think I'll just use these little guys since I only need two of them. And that way I don't waste all of these in case I want to use them at some other point in time. I'm not real concerned about like using this kit again um, because I probably won't, <laughs> to be perfectly honest with you. Um, like I don't enjoy the art enough to want to use it like a second time. I mean, it's pretty, but... It's just not my style as much. 
as some other ones that I really, really love that I would like to use like over and over again. You know what I mean? But I do want to use like as much of it as possible because it is really, really pretty. So there's that. Okay, I think I want a quote for here because we don't really have any like quote box kind of stickers. So I think I might do a quote and then maybe one of the tall girls Monday. Um, I just don't really like this outfit. So I might not use that one. I might not use the short box of that girl either. I think it's the hat that I'm not a fan of. Um, but I'll do this here. And then I think I'll put the quote here. I don't know what quote I'm going to use yet, but I know I have a ton of hollow quotes because we got a bunch when we did the SPC Advent, I think, is when we got a ton of them. <laughs> um, yeah, so like this girl, I don't know that I'll use her either, but I really love her. Okay, Tuesday... Tuesday, let's do this one. And this one. Sometimes I like to do that where I kind of hold them up and layer them while I'm holding them because it's easier to see than on the page and then I just kind of hold them and stick them down okay definitely want like a full scene over here because I don't want to split it so I think I'll just do Okay, this is the same problem as last week, that there's this itty bitty, itty bitty, teeny weeny, little tiny strip that goes between the boxes that makes them not line up perfectly. So if you don't separate them, it's kind of weird. Okay, this is so extra, but like literally it doesn't take very long. It just feels really stupidly extra, but it helps. It helps you guys. So if you're trying to do this, I do recommend because otherwise they just don't quite line up and then you're like, wait, what? And you do end up with this like little white line between, but I think it's less noticeable than the pattern lining up incorrectly, in my opinion. There we go. Okay, so there's like a tiny white line, but to me that's less intrusive than the incorrect pattern. These are my Simply Gilded um, scissors that came in the sub. I really like them, they're really nice. And just easy, quick to grab. Okay, this is Thursday, so I think we'll just take like the loungewear kind of situation. And then Friday, I'll do the planner. And I don't have washi down here. I do have, like, the overlay washi. And I could put this here and here and then do... Um, actually, yeah, let's do that. I could do the... I don't know what I'm saying. What am I saying, you guys? Oh, the weekend manner. <laughs> Oh my god. I'm gonna wipe that one out too because sometimes I feel like it goes all the way up there. So we'll use the bows just because they're a little bit more lavender than the confetti because I feel like I could pull the confetti into any hollow spread but the bows have a little bit more like I said the lavender pattern. Now do I want to keep the line and put the bows on the line? Or do I want to wipe the line out? I 
think I'll keep it. That way I have something straight to line it up with. There's like fuzzy. Is that underneath? Oh man. So I'm trying to put the middle of the bow on the line. Okay. Now, maybe what I'll do, since I have too many hands going here, is I'll just cut this. Because, oops, it's clear. I think it's gonna storm, which is really exciting. It's getting really, really dark and gray out. And I'm really excited. Okay, we've got this girl. Did I run out of boxes? <laughs> I think I have one more, don't I? Somewhere. This one. This one's not my favorite, but I think I prefer it over the girl. I mean, I could do the girl and this. I don't know. Okay. All right, we'll do both of them here. We'll do her here. I love her, she's so gorgeous. So the only full box I skipped, I think, is this one, which again, I just don't care for the outfit and the hat and I don't know. This one's just a little smaller, toned down, I guess. Okay, weekend banner. Here we go. And maybe I'll put this one up here since we have the bows in the middle and I don't really want to cover the bow. I feel like I should do some glitter headers because they're super pretty. So let's add some of these in. For no reason at all except to be pretty. Love it so far. Um, we need more. <gasps> I forgot I could have used. Oh man. Um, we had the date covers. That would have been a little bit more bold. Okay. Can't use those anymore, but we'll have to remember. I also had a hollow weekend banner, but I feel like that's not as big of a deal. But we definitely, I won't use the, um, what are these, half cut headers and probably, probably not the header overlays, but we definitely have some like full box overlays that I can use. And again, these look more just kind of regular hollow than the, the solid, like the matte version like this version that looks more purple um so we're just gonna use more try to use more of this and if i have these kind of hollow leftovers i think they'll pull into a regular spread just fine i hope what do you guys think so far do you like the purpley lavender orchid <laughs> hollow stuff. I think this will fit up at the top. I don't know if it's gonna look funny or not. Maybe I'll just cut out the one bow. Okay, where are we going to put her? Up here on Saturday? Whoa, thank goodness that didn't stick. <laughs> okay, we'll put that over here on Saturday. Cute, I like, I like, I like. Okay, what do we need to do? I think we need to start on Monday. 
because I'm getting confused. Although, yeah, Monday. All right, <laughs> I have my little to-do list. This is for work. Um, and I do have a work sticker, but I think I might use this on Tuesday because Tuesday is the last day of work. So this will be any final things that need to get done. Monday, it's gonna be kind of like whatever I need to finish. I love that weekend banner. Okay, so Monday is Memorial Day. And I think I'm gonna put this up here. Yeah. Okay, we'll put that there. Hopefully when I put a foil sticker over it, it won't look quite as weird. Memorial Day on Monday, which is technically a day off, but I will have things I need to do because I'm pretty sure I can't get them all done tomorrow. I mean, maybe if I feel real good tomorrow, maybe, but today was kind of a wash. Okay, um, yes, then Tuesday, oh, I need a quote sticker also. Tuesday is the last day of work. So I think we're gonna put this like foil box although I feel like that should go down here because then like then I'll actually be done I don't want to mark it before I actually finish right <laughs> okay so that'll be for last day of work that's really fun um work last day of work laundry laundry needs to happen Tuesday, but what should I mark it with? Okay, we have a laundry script. So, what do I want it on? Ooh, maybe one of these. A little like rounded ones. Maybe the light pink one. Cute. All right, so put laundry here. Perfect. Laundry on Tuesday. Wednesday, this is summer break. So again, I wanna use like this hollow, big, this big hollow box because it's like, woohoo, we finally made it. Summer break. And then my main goal on Wednesday, Thursday is to work on my power sheets. Um, so I definitely want to do that. I also want to mark planning time on Thursday. Although after, after this week that I'm currently planning, I have no idea what my plans are going to look like. And I think I want to use a flag because why not? have so many stickers. All right, so we'll put planning time here on Thursday, but then I want to mark power sheets separately. Maybe I'll use half boxes, like this one and this one maybe. So I'll put power sheets in here and I'll put power sheets maybe up here okay so those are gonna be for power sheets um Wednesday I should put the sleep in sticker because hello that's probably gonna happen okay sleep in I wanted on one of these Maybe this one. I like how this kind of like, it kind of goes up and then down. I don't know, it's cute. Sleep in. Okay. So there's sleeping in. Power sheets, power sheets. Okay, Thursday I also have a bill due. And I think she has bill due. 
she does let's take this color because the gray is a little bit more universal and it looks like it's gonna be kind of awkward in spacing so let's wipe those out put that in the middle and that is my phone bill so yep we have a phone icon and I think she said we got these sheets kind of for free or something because they're kind of wonky and they totally are like can you see it looks like something was like spilled on it um but she said it just like didn't foil properly um so we got these like matte ones for free and then they reprinted the clear version or something like that so I'm not mad about it okay planning time I want to put one of the little planners we have so many and let's see none of these are like a planner I use so I feel like it doesn't really matter I just want it to be cute <laughs> um yeah that works okay so Thursday bill do power sheets oh I could put planners on the power sheets ones too let's do it okay put a planner there this like the power sheets look nothing like this but it's okay it's okay <laughs> and we'll put matching ones just in different colors to hopefully remind me what goes there look at that foil unreal this one looks like sunset over here okay Friday Friday I want to tidy up I forget do we have that on here or like cleaning day no what lazy day movie day workout and my feelings no cleaning one okay do we have cleaning icons should look over here Food. Okay, well, I'm going to use one of these because we get so many. <laughs> and we'll put a cleaning day in here. I have like a tidy up or clean or something like that that I can put here. Um, Saturday, oh, and then we need film edit upload. Okay, I should put deco in here. done you guys okay so here's Monday Tuesday so I put nobody can take away your work ethic just to not like as a theme for the week but a theme for Monday Tuesday <laughs> um you saw me put in the Memorial Day the no school grading check emails and then I wrote post grades as like an ideal hopefully I can post grades Monday and then after posting I have to email to get them checked off so I put a little reminder on like what I need to do there and I think that little box worked out really cute um maybe I'll put a little computer or something 
there. Um, I feel like she has a computer icon. Yeah. Okay, we'll put a little computer just to, just to extra remind. Cute. All right, and then I put grading check emails, and then here I put away message because we need to put like an, like, so if somebody emails us, it bounces back to them and says that we're on summer break um, for that. And then my grades do. And I don't know if you can see. I can see in person. The middle one is like a silver hollow. And then you have the lavender hollow. And I can definitely tell the difference. But silver hollow works with this also. This is also silver hollow. Um, so you can see kind of the background color is different. I don't know. It's pretty small, so I'm not sure if you can really see it. And then we have the laundry. Did we have a laundry icon? I feel like she has some weird icons sometimes. Like, I don't know. Like, I would much rather use an icon for laundry than for, like, a plain and haircut weekly. <laughs> um, it's just not... Not what I'm doing every week. Okay, and then we have the summer break, um, the sleep in, and then these are both going to be power sheets, my phone bill, planning time, film edit upload, I should clean, and that's about it. I think I'm going to wipe this out. I was going to say delete it. <laughs> this is for taking statistics, and then on June 1st, I'll do goals. So, yeah. The hollow is really fun. I'm really glad I added in. I feel like this box needs something, but I don't know. I can't always get out my regular hollow. Um, but I'm sure I'll pull in more foil as the week goes on, like I usually do in like more colors and stuff. So again, this previous week was Glam Planner. And then we're currently on a Scribble Prince Co. kit, which I know I've used a lot of Scribble Glam Planner and Scribble Prints Co. lately, um, but because I have the subs, like, sometimes I get a little overwhelmed with how many are in my collection. <laughs> I also did buy the uh, Glam Planner Summer Mystery Kit today. So there's that. That's going to be coming. I'm excited. Okay, let me know what you guys think of this kit. Is this your style? Um, do you like how I paired it with the Lavender Hollow? Is it too much Lavender Hollow? Is it too much Lavender? Is it too much anything? Is it not enough to like pull off the Lavender Hollow? Well, I think it's fine, but I'm not as picky as some people are. So let me know what you think about that. And like I said, is this your style kit? It's, it's still not really mine, but I think it's pretty. The colors are pretty. Um, so overall, like I enjoy it, but it's not like me. Um, and it's definitely kind of weird for like a summer break starting kit. But again, this will be the first week where I'm like staying at home and not really working after Tuesday, Monday, Tuesday, I'll be working. Oh, tell me what else. What are you doing for Memorial Day? Um, it's probably Memorial Day when I'm posting this. But tell me if you're getting to do anything. All right, that's it for me. My voice can't take anymore. I'm still sick and I need to go. So, <laughs> um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will catch you in the next video. Hit that subscribe button on your way out if you haven't already. And if you have, thank you so much. I enjoy you guys being here so, so, so much. All right, talk to you next time.